Hey, it's Chris Chico, and in this video, I'm going to share with you how we made $25,344 on a wholesale deal in a tiny town in Texas with TikTok ads to firm motivated sellers. And this is for you if you're a real estate wholesaler looking to do more deals. You love to be able to have incoming warm leads that are raising their hands and saying, yes, I'm interested in selling my property at a discount without you actually having to do any cold calling. And this is a great method for you if you are looking to start a wholesaling business, but most importantly, even if you're experienced and you're looking to grow and to scale, online lead generation is the best way to do that. So let's get right down to it. Now, in this video, I'm gonna share with you how we found the deal, what we paid for the deal, how much we sold it for. So I'm gonna go through every single little detail so that that way you know exactly how this happened. Now, let's see here. Let's first of all talk about, make sure they understand my model. My model is 100% virtual, meaning that we are never physically inspecting any of these properties. We are never meeting with the buyers or the sellers. We're doing deals nationwide. So rather than being in one particular market, we are spread across 15 to 20 different states. Uh, this is the real estate wholesaling model, meaning that we're not doing any subject to. We're doing every once in a while an ovation. If you don't know what that is, don't worry about it. Predominantly, 95% of what we're doing is wholesaling. Now, these are incoming leads. It says income leads, but I'm too, I'm not going to redo this, the video just for that slide. Incoming leads, meaning these are people that are raising their hands and saying, yes, I'm interested in selling my property at a discount. They fill out a form online. And so when you call them, they know and they are expecting for you to reach out to them. Everything that we do is 100% digital ads. That means that we are placing ads on Facebook, on TikTok, and on Google. And that's how we are finding our prospects. At the end of the video, I'll share with you another video you can watch that will give you the details on how those campaigns work. Now, we found a deal using TikTok, and I want to make sure that I uh, also share a couple comments about TikTok because, you know, there's been talk lately about TikTok, and obviously there's a law that was passed basically saying that TikTok is going to be outlawed and uh, in beginning of January, then they need to cease operations. And people were wondering, well, is that viable? Does that make it not viable? Should I even waste my time? And the fact is, is that TikTok isn't going away. These are articles just published in the last 24 hours, how TikTok is allegedly coming up with a algorithm to allow it to stay in the US. So it's a separate algorithm between uh, the US and between uh, China. And so I wanted to mention that because TikTok is a great opportunity. It's another source of deals, even if it was completely going to be banned in January, which is not the case based on what I hear, I see here, I would still push into it because there's lots of money to be made. However, the long-term viability of this platform is high, very high because it's just not going to go away. And even if this doesn't happen, there's other people that are interested in buying the platform, but this is certainly a good sign for us. And I'm really, really excited about this. Let's talk about the property address. This was a property at 2419 Memorial Drive in Bryan, Texas. All right, now, uh, this is how the house looked like. It was actually a townhouse uh, that uh, was was the lead. And, um, you know, Bryan, Texas is not a major metro, or at least it would give you the appearance that, wow, this is a really small area, and would it be worth it to do a deal here? Would it, would it be possible to find a buyer? Uh, but in fact, uh, Bryan, Texas, and I didn't particularly know Bryan, Texas until we actually got this deal, is uh, located in um, the, the Bryan, Texas is where uh, Texas A&M University is. In fact, I didn't know that until um, the lead came in. And uh, there's lots of activity in this market. If you look at the Zillow uh, in terms of active properties, and these are properties up to $500,000, there's quite a bit of uh, red dots here, which means that there's uh, a lot of activity in the market. Now, one of the things that we notice and we look at right away is in the market is whether or not there's a lot of pending activity. On the left are, if you notice, uh, you can see that it says uh, agent. Uh, the, one, uh, the, the screenshot on the left is active properties. These are uh, uh, listed with an agent, 1,096. To the right is actually the total inventory when you select pending and under contract. That means there's really almost 1,500 properties, but a thousand of them are active. So that means that there is 500 of them that are pending. So if we take and uh, we consider 500 pending uh, divided by the 1500, then we get 33% of the total market inventory 
is pending, which is a great number. That's what you want to see in any one of these smaller markets. You want to see a lot of activity. Now, um, the source of the deal ended up being it is it was from TikTok. The source originally was from TikTok. We got the deal from our one of our joint pet, uh, venture partners. So we uh, we have different programs. This is not a pitch for any of those programs where uh, the students we set up the ads for the students and then we teach them how to run the ads and then we also help them along in terms of getting deals done. And if they need help in terms of maybe they have a full time job and they don't they don't have the time, if they need help in selling the deals, they can submit the deals to us and then we will go ahead and find the buyers. Uh, transact, uh, you know, coordinate the closing and do everything and then uh, get the deal to close. And that's where this deal came from. Uh, the seller situation here, this is how the deal comes in into our system internally. And uh, when you look at the image on the right, it says seller situation is it says father is ill and wants to move in uh, with father to help care, take, take care of the dad. Uh, father lives in a different city. So that was the circumstances. And uh, I thought I, I found it interesting uh, on the additional comments. Uh, this is from our deal partner. Uh, he mentioned that he was trying to work with some other guy to sell his home, but the guy kept on rescheduling to see the home. So Michael got tired and decided to go with me. So this is really important because, you know, with a lot of these property owners, you know, there's there's always people swirling around interested in their property. And so there's always competition. And so this illustrates the fact that, you know, number one is you got to know what you're doing in terms of knowing what to say, having great conversation with property owners. Uh, but many times speed is the thing that makes the difference. Meaning if you have a great deal, you have a, a situation that comes up with a lead that you feel that's a legitimate deal, then you want to be able to move quickly on that because somebody could easily come and take that deal uh, away from you and take the opportunity away from you. Now, the value on this on Zillow was 170 $76,000. That was what the estimate of Zillow. I think it was a little bit less just because uh, Zillow was taking into consideration the various uh, other single family residential properties in the area. But still, nevertheless, it was a great deal. Uh, we ended up uh, assigning uh, the original contract that we had with the seller was for $61,756. $61,756. Uh, you can see here that the deposit on the deal was only $100. So if you're looking at this and wondering as a beginner that you'd have to put up a lot, a lots of money in terms of deposits for doing these type of deals, that is certainly not the case. And we sold the deal for $87,000. Uh, that's what the assignment was uh, on the deal. And uh, we got uh, on the lower right, it shows here, signed with PandaDoc, just to let you guys know. That's what we use for us to get all contracts and documents signed, either with buyers or with sellers. Um, our take on the deal, this is our wire. It's actually for half of the deal because the uh, other half was given to our, our deal partner, $12,672. And that was uh, 50% of the deal. Now, what I want you to do next is I want you to go ahead and click on this next video that walks you through step by step and, and reveals to you exactly how we run these campaigns, the images that we use and how much it costs in order to get these type of leads. And that way you can figure out if, in fact, this just might be the strategy that is best for you. Check it out.